Assalamualaikum. I am MS Mazhar from Nova CSS Academy, Islamabad, and in this column crux, I will give you the main points and cruises of different important columns published in the Express Tribune and dawn of 28 May 2024. First of all, I will share with you the crux of the column published in the Express Tribune. The first column is how to make war crimes accountable. This column has been contributed by Dr. Munis Ahmer. In this column, first of all, the writer throws light on how the International Criminal Court and International Court of Justice reached their verdicts against the Israeli Prime Minister and Defense Minister and three top Hamas leaders of conducting war crimes. In the second part of this column, the writer tells us that since ICC and ICJ are toothless bodies, so their verdicts are not honored by such powerful criminals as the Prime Minister and Defense Minister of Israel. I strongly recommend reading this column to the students of international law. The second important column from the Express Tribune is the U.S. Nuclear Forces in 2024. This column has been contributed by Dr. Zafar Khan. In this column, the writer first of all educates us about the superiority of the United States of America over its rivals Russia and China in the nuclear war games and their delivery system. The writer tells us that the United States of America will be able to maintain its hegemony in the world affairs thanks to its powerful European and Asian allies and this bloc will try to push the rival countries into conflicts and wars which does not augur well for the world peace. The writer also tells us that the United States of America will be able to maintain its defense and its defense will remain unchallenged and the United States of America will also be able to maintain its lead in the global economy. And now I share with you the important points of an important column from the dawn of 28 May 2024. The title of this column is more difficult now. This column has been penned down by Niaz Murtaza. In this column, the writer first of all explores the reasons which led to the all-encompassing control of the establishment on all political personalities, process and elections. The writer includes in these reasons the real or perceived threats from India, wars in Afghanistan and the inability of our politicians to deliver the goods. However, according to this columnist, the entry and then ouster of PTI in the power has changed the dynamics of the game and now the powerful establishment has to take certain unusual measures to maintain their control on political process. The signs of these unusual measures are seen all around us. In my opinion, reading this column is very important to understand the new dynamics of civil military relationships, which is an important topic for the candidates for the competitive examination of Pakistan. My dear students, now I will share with you the main points of important editorials published in either of these two newspapers, The Dawn as well as The Express Tribune of 28 May 2024. I have actually selected only one editorial from each of these two newspapers and the subject of these editorials is the same. The editorial which I am sharing with you on this subject from The Dawn is titled Afghan puzzle. In this editorial, the newspaper tells us about the enigma that the perpetrators of Bisham incident in which Chinese workers were killed at the hands of KTP are still hiding in Afghanistan which is providing safe havens to TTP and it is not 
handing over the perpetrators of uh, different terrorist activities uh, to Pakistan or trying them in their own country. The Dawn editorial tells us that since Afghan Taliban are earnestly trying to get Chinese investment in their country, therefore China should play a very positive role to make the Afghan Taliban pay heed to Pakistan's demand and either try the perpetrators of Chinese killers in their own country or hand them over to Pakistan. The similar subject has been dealt with by the Express Tribune whose editorial is titled Bisham Perpetrators. My dear students, I hope that today's column crux would help you a great deal to use your time smartly and read only the selected material because your time is precious and these are the important columns and main points of important editorials which I have put before you in this short video. Tomorrow, I hope to see you with more column crux taking cruises from the columns and editorials from Express Tribune as well as dawn of 29th of May 2024. Till then and beyond, Allah Hafiz.